Hello everyone and welcome once again to your home decor channel Mimi's Glam and Designs. Today is a special video because we are celebrating 5k. Thank you all so much. We reached there and we already passed that. And as part of my gratitude, I have partnered up with to Natalie at Totally Dazzle where we will be having a giveaway and giving you a $50 gift card so you can use in Totally Dazzle. I will be announcing the rules through this video, so stay through the whole video so you can learn how you can enter to this giveaway. Now, so this video was so far due, I am having a living room tour for you guys and I will be sharing major updates that I did to my living room. So let's begin. First thing that you guys can see and it's obvious is the rug. I went ahead and changed my rug for this shag rug and this one I purchased it on Amazon but you can find it in different stores online. The brand is Safra Vie and I absolutely recommend it. Definitely change this whole living room. It has a luxury feeling now. In the beginning I wasn't sure about the color because I was afraid it was going to be too silver because that's the color but when I arrived I absolutely love that it has like different shades depending on the lighting so sometimes it looks darker sometimes it looks brighter and I love that and it's very soft I have to say that so I am so happy with this purchase. And this rug will be added to my Amazon store so if you guys are interested you can just go there and that will be on the description box below i'm gonna link my amazon store and to refresh my home this new year i also changed the pillow covers and this is a great way to update your living room without spending a lot of money these are crushed velvet it's called the material and the color of this one is silver gray it is on my amazon store like i said and the price was so affordable 760 for a 19 by 19 that's the size that i picked and this is just a great way to save space for storage, you guys. And at the same time, you can just change your whole living room feeling by updating your pillow covers. The other silver one, it is from Amazon as well. It was two for $14, so that was pretty affordable as well. And then the middle one, the white one, is like a sea gallery one. But this one I found at Ross for $12.99. It was a steal, guys. And so the rest of the pillows are the same ones, just I spread them around. You guys ask me a lot of questions about my couch and it is from Cedar Furniture and unfortunately it's out of stock so I have to say that so you guys know but they do have a similar option. Another major change that happened on my living room was the wall art. The other one was a little bit old so I opted to add this one and this is a DIY that I put together. I'm going to be linking it on the right side of the screen right here and also at the end of this video. So if you're interested to learn how I made this beautiful piece, just click on the video at the end of this one. I am also thinking to change this mirror piece and move it to my dining room and then work on another project that I have in mind. So let me know what you guys think of that. Leave me a comment down below. When it came to my coffee table, I changed the basket underneath and I used this beautiful fur basket that I picked up at home because it was like a Christmas basket. So I never seen anything like this, so I picked it up immediately. It was like $25, but it brought a bunch of chocolates inside, so it was a good deal. I also saw a similar one in Pottery Barn. But that was like $30 without the chocolate, so I picked this one up. And so I keep this one here for candles and remotes. When it came down to styling my coffee table, I wanted to bring the glam out and at the same time being very simple and refreshing. So I'm using my tray that I picked up, I believe it was Burlington. It's been a while, you guys. And then I'm using this gorgeous lantern that it was on sale for $10, I believe 12 at walmart.com. And it was a steal because it's absolutely gorgeous. I'm also using my Chanel book. This is a set of three. And it is like $50, but it comes with three books. You can use the whole box like this, or you can use them individually. And then so inside, I added this candle holder that I DIY myself. Let me know if you guys want to see a video on that. 
leave me a comment down below and i also added this pretty candle that i picked up in christmas season for like three dollars yes believe it three dollars at michael's it was on sale from ten dollars to three and right next to it i'm styling it also with this beautiful topiary that we diy together i love the crystals inside it brings the glam out and i also love the black roses it's so unique and so uncommon and right next to it i'm styling this gorgeous glove that i picked up at rose oh my god you guys when i saw this i picked it up immediately the price was $16.99 and I really love how unique it was. I've never seen it in the store, in any of the stores or even online. So I thought it was a steal. I really love how much glam it brings to my living room that it makes a statement, definitely. And I'm styling this and to give it some dimension, I'm using this Chanel box. I ordered something from Chanel, so it came in this box and I'm just using this to give it a little bit of height and also my other Chanel book and also this diamond that i picked up at michael's for like 50 percent off it came out to four dollars now on this side of the living room and on this couch i'm using my pompon throw that i picked up at burlington and then these pretty pillows sequence below the white one is from amazon and i love how you can change the shape and the design and then the little bowl pillow is from walmart and it is on sale actually for ten dollars i got it for 16.99 And part of refreshing my living room, I also decided to change the shade of the lamp before it was gray. So I think this white one brightened up the space and I really love the neutral tones. I also changed this side table and this one was picked up by my mom from a thrift store for $5 and I really love the antique style. So we will be transforming this table. For now, I just added some Dollar Tree mirrors on top and I really have to work on it. Let me know if this is a project that you will be interested in doing with me. And so I'm styling this coffee table with these gorgeous books that I DIY myself using Dollar Tree items. If you would like to see those, let me know. And I did record the video, I just didn't post it yet. They look so chic and pretty. And I'm also using this pineapple that I picked up at Burlington for like $5.99 or $6.99 and also my candle holder that i picked up last year but i never saw it with you guys also from burlington brand is bb for 16.99 i'm also using this dollar tree eiffel tower and of course a beautiful set of coasters that i picked up at home goods these coasters are amazing I think I regret not getting the second set. They were like $16.99, but it's so worth it, you guys. It comes in a little set, so you can just stack them in there. And they have so much sparkles. They are so glam, and they are metal, so it's a pretty good material. I've been getting a lot of questions about my fireplace and how did I put it together. So I'm going to go ahead and show you in details everything that is behind it on this wall and also about the color of the walls. I also get a lot of questions so I'm just going to leave the detail of the paint on the description box below and the name for you guys. And so the way I am styling it right now, I just added this pretty basket that I picked up at TJ Maxx and I added my Sears throw and i also add a couple of pillows the sparkly one and then the white one is the same one as the silver one but this one is white it's the crushed velvet i'm also styling this giant flower with this base that i picked up at burlington last year and this giant flower is the start of the show you guys everybody loves it i really love how it looks like i picked it up at hobby lobby i really didn't know what i was gonna do with it at first but i really love this spot for this flower so she may just stay here and side to side i'm using the same lanterns that i have on my coffee table with some lights from the dollar tree and the way i style this wall 
it was using these pretty frames that I picked up at Ross. They were like 16 to $20 for a set of three. And they look really beautiful here. They definitely bring a wild wow factor. And for me, it's all about functionality. And that's why I decided to wall mount the TV. That way I save a lot of room and it just looks very minimalist and modern. I wanted to accent it with these pretty bricks these are from floor and decor and i love how sparkly they are only from clothes you can see how sparkly they are and then i added this fireplace it's also wall mounted and it was installed before the, the bricks this one has three settings you can turn it on only the fire or the flame and then the other one gives you heat. Obviously, I don't use it at all because I am in Florida and it's pretty hot in here. And I also added these crystals inside. It was an idea that I saw on All Things Katie Santana with Katie and I went ahead and added on mine and thank you so much for the idea. So this electric fireplace is from eBay and I got it a while ago guys so I don't have the link to that but there are a bunch of them on Amazon also new ones and more modern than this one I'm sure and so on top I added this double shelf to put my cable box and before I had a DVD but now they went outdated so I don't need it anymore so instead I replaced that with this pretty lotus flower candle holder that I picked up at Home Goods for $29.99 only and it is similar to the C Gallery one I wanted this candle holder forever but I could never find it so I'm so glad I picked it up at Home Goods finally and on top is the sound bar. This is a Samsung sound bar, and this one is uh, wireless to the subwoofer. The subwoofer is actually hidden in another place, so it's pretty seamless, and I really like that. And then on top, we just have the TV. My chandelier is from eBay, and I love how unique it is. That's what caught my attention when I purchased it. And I forgot to mention this pretty blanket, but this is a Z Gallery like blanket. I really wanted the Z Gallery one, but it was like $70. So obviously I was not gonna pay that kind of money for a blanket. So I ended up picking this one up at Home Goods. When I saw it, I went crazy. So I got it for like $30. I'm not sure it was, if it was priced wrong, but that was a really good deal. Now another major change that occurred in my home, it was the drapes or the curtains. I went ahead and removed the old ones and I also raised the height of the curtains and now you guys see they look so luxury and the bringing the curtains up definitely make the space look bigger and I really love that. Also these drapes are from Burlington and I couldn't be more happy you guys, they were like $30 for a pack of two and they're pretty white so they are fox leather when I first saw them I wasn't sure about the leather I thought it was gonna be too wild but oh I was so wrong you guys because they give so much elegance to my living room that I can't even tell you I mean you guys can see it with your own eyes so they are 96 inches high so yes I'm pretty happy with this change and one section of my home that I didn't show you guys in detail, it is this corner bar. And this is like the front side of the living room. And this is great for entertaining. And this bar, it is from Wayfair. And I love how spacious it is and it allows me to store a lot of things. And the way I am styling it right now is I'm using all these pretty items that I'm gonna walk you through. So the first one, it is this shaker or mixer. This one I picked it up at Home Goods last Christmas and it is truly beautiful. You guys can see it for yourself. There is so much glam to it. I also picked up this um, cocktail set. This one was from Ross and I believe it was like $12. The mixer was $16.99. And I am having that on top of this tray that I picked up at Michael's for like $5 after coupons. Then I went to Home Goods and I saw this beautiful and gorgeous ice bucket. OMG, you guys, I couldn't let this go. I had to bring it home. It was like $30, but it is super beautiful. And I feel like it's a timeless piece that you can use all the time. 
Now on the right side, I have this pretty set that I ordered online from Z Gather, And I really love all the details and the sparkles. It's like for shots and I really like that. And I also love the sparkles on top, the silver around the ice bucket. It is really, really beautiful. And I'm styling it on top of this tree that I picked up at Ross for like $9.99 or $7.99. I decided to add the pendant lights. These ones are from Lowe's because they bring like the bar feeling. And I really love the design, it's very modern. And to accent the walls right here, I'm using this canvas that I picked up at Burlington. I believe it was a while ago, guys, so forgive me if I don't remember exactly the price. And it is Travel the World, and that's me on the right side, Traveling the World. And I really have a passion for traveling, so this goes perfect with my whole theme. I also keep here on these shelves that I picked up, I believe, a rose as well. I so I keep my souvenirs and then also these pretty frames with quotes that I picked up at Ross for like $5.99 each one and so I also have this collage of pictures of the places that I've been some of them now behind the bar I have this tool that it is from Amazon and then I wanted to add a wild factor to this section and I added this pretty lights one is blue and one is pink and together on top they give you like the purple color so I really love how it brings like the party vibes into the house and they're great for entertaining like I said before now let's talk about giveaway rules so the rules are very simple all you have to do is be subscribed to my channel here on YouTube and leave me a comment down below saying I want to enter and for extra entries all you have to do is follow me on Instagram and make sure you do because I will check if you follow me on Instagram remember this will give you extra entries you don't have to be on Instagram to win this giveaway it's just for additional entries but I would love to have you there so even if you don't want to enter to the giveaway I would love to get to know you better and follow me on Instagram at Mimi's Designs where I share all the updates that I do to my home so definitely I would love to see you there guys this giveaway will close on Sunday the 17th that means next Sunday and the winner will be announced next Monday the 18th so make sure to share this video with your friends and family so they can get also chances to win this gift card thank you all so much for watching and for your love and support I love you guys and I'll see you next time ciao